Hi folks, Tyler Capozzi here with a tutorial on how to add timecode to your project in Adobe Premiere Pro. Very quick and easy to do, a variety of reasons you may want to do it. Maybe you're sending a project out for feedback and you want a precise way for your peers to tell you when they think that something should be added, omitted, changed. This is especially important for music. Maybe it's for watermarking your footage or sending for closed captioning. There are a ton of reasons you might want timecode, but let's jump right into it. All you want to do is click on file, click on new, and then click on transparent video. These settings should be the same as your timeline, so make sure those match. Click on OK. That will add transparent video to your project panel. Now you want to drag this down into your timeline, making sure that it's above whatever the highest most used track of video is. In my case, V5, so I'll want it to go onto V6. So just drag it down onto it, and of course, I want it to span the length of the entire project, so just click and drag it for however long you want the time code to be in frame. Let's try that again. Perfect, so now it spans the length of the project. Now we'll go to effects and type in time code or just time and time code is under the video tab in video effects and then you'll click and drag that down onto your transparent video layer. Here are all our settings for it. As you can see, it does not match though. Our current time should be reading out at all zeros but we're getting 59 so to change that all we need to do is change time code source to clip so just click on clip and now as you can see it will match so your entire project now has time code laced throughout it in this small little bar hope you find that helpful enjoy and until next time i'm tyler cabozzi and you are not later